Hey everybody, and welcome back to Okami. In the last part, we set out on the search for the Kuso for the Satomi Canine Warriors. We found five within Kusa Village, and the other three, I had a hard time actually finding them because I forgot the exact order that I am supposed to find them in. Well, we got one of them in Kamiki Village. Uh, there's one in uh, and it got to force that we can't get yet, but the other one here. And Salsa Sanctuary, which we unlocked in the last part, uh, we can get. Oh, and I got the wire spout technique too, so that's awesome. But we're here for the dog. So, if we look at our map, it's through here. Also, I want I want to mention. Uh, apologies if my uh, sound setup, if if I sound just a little bit off. Uh, you saw the video. You saw the video with my setup. Uh, yeah, that's that's why. Although I'm sure you guys could have guessed that already. Anyways, uh, okay, so there's nothing over here. Okay, so I guess we got ourselves a little big uh, bamboo area. Oh, oh, no birds! Don't fly off. I want to feed you. Don't want. Don't fly away hungry. Give us some praise. Thank you very much. Now then. We can continue up here. Let's see. Uh, aw. What's up to this guy? Mm, well, get a little tweety here. Hey, what's with all the chirping, kid? Don't call me, kid. I have a name, you know. It's Tay? Ty? I don't know. And I'm not chirping. I'm crying. Well, I guess that is how birds will cry. Cry baby tie. Aw, game. Oh, you're crying. So, what's with that freaky cry of yours? Take's lost. He disappeared while we were out for a walk. Uh, who's Take? Is he a friend of yours? He's my dog. I lost my dog. Hello. I guess that's no surprise. Oh, the canine tracker suddenly appeared. That must mean... Yep. His dog is one of the Satomi canine warriors. I can't say I'm surprised, but then again, I've played this game before. So, of course, I'm not surprised. Um... Oh, there's a treasure around here somewhere. Uh... It's, I, it, no, it is nighttime right now. So, I should be able to find it. Um, I know there's a treasure out here. Where is it? Oh, glow. Oh, oh, there's tigers over here. All right, hey, have some meat. Eat up. Now give us some praise. That's right. You know who's boss. Okay. Hmm. You said I see Yami. Unless I'm hallucinating or something. That bamboo over there? Looks like it's flashing. Maybe we'll find something interesting inside if we cut it down. Yeah. It's not just one bamboo flashing. Uh, it, different, a different one flashes at a different moment. What's up with that? Um, well, you know what? Just to make it easier on myself, I'm going to slice them all down. No, no. You're supposed to cut down the bamboo that's lit up. It's so obvious. Yeah, you can't cheat it like that. I'm sorry, this one's glowing. We'll cut this. Bingo! So, was this dog just teleporting between bamboo shoots somehow? I don't get that. What's a dog doing in there? Uh, I, I don't know. And that doesn't... And I still have, don't have an answer to, that la to the last dog that was sitting in a bamboo shoot. In a bamboo stalk, I don't know. Take! Take's back! Take? What's wrong, boy? Why are you growling? Wait a minute. Was it this white wolf who spirited you away? Oh, give me a break. Hey, wait. I think this flea bot's trying to say something. Hmm? White wolf. What right do you have to bear the canine tracker? Fight me, and prove that you are worthy. Okay. Gee. You hear that, Ami? 
This must be one of the canine warriors. That canine tracker really set him off. What'll it be, Yami? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna pick a fight. Bring it on, dude. I Means this is this one on one. I will, I will win. Bring it on. Hmm. Yeah, he takes a bit of damage from. Uh... Oh, no, he's not gonna take damage now. I forgot the name of my weapon, but he takes a bit of damage from it. That's for sure. All right, come on. <laughs> Knocks you down on the ground. Get sliced. In fact, why don't you have a bomb? Ow. Oh, really? You kicked dirt at me. Yeah, thanks. Where are you going, huh? Come on. <laughs> okay, you are almost done for. Oh. Okay, I was wondering where you were going to do another, uh, like, a different attack. And that's it. Please tell me I got a good time ranking on that. Yes! Perfect ranking. Very nice. Cut it out! Leave him alone! I won't allow you to bully Take like that. Keep it up, and I'll clobber you. Oh, what are you going to do, buddy? Wait a second, Tweety. We're not bullying anybody. Right, you flea bag? Come on, say something. I know Princess Fuse summons me. It is my duty to defeat Crimson Helm, Defiler of the Gale Shrine. But I cannot return. This place is in grave danger. The monsters will overrun Sauce Sanctuary without me. And the Sparrow Tribe, they would all be... What shall I do? You don't have to do anything. I think your orb is going to speak for you. Because it's going to come with me. Thank you very much. And I got the duty orb. What's this? The power orb has chosen you. I need worry no longer. It. Uh, I think you mean the duty orb. Uh, I think that... I don't know if that's a mistranslation or a typo. I'll let you guys decide that. Even separated. The hearts of the canine warriors beat us one. Huh? Hey, wait a second. Okay. Okay. Uh, there's a treasure over here somewhere. Where are you? Oh, little bunnies. Here. Have some herbs. Well, anyways. I know there's something in this little spot right here. Just know it. It wouldn't be here. I mean, it's not here for no reason. He's still mad, apparently. Well, sucks to be him. Actually, what does he say? Yeah, you know what? You deserve that. Why does he deserve that, you ask? Uh, because I said so. Um, okay. Oh, that's taken care of. Okay, so now we have one more dog to find in a Gata Forest. I can't even run over that. Okay. Alright, well, I will see you guys back there then. Oh, actually, no. Before I go, there's something I can do now. If I talk to Mr. Bamboo, yeah, he does this. <sighs> what a fabulous hot spring. Wolfly, I heard a ruckus from afar, but why don't you wash off all that grime in the hot spring? Hot spring? I think we'll pass. Anyway, isn't it about time you start looking for bamboo? Oh, you're right. The festival is just around the corner. It falls on the night of the full moon. The night of the full moon? Yep, Kamiki Village holds the Kamiki Festival on the night of the full moon during this time of year. You've heard the legend. Ugh. Of how the great heroes uh, Nagi and Shirunui defeated the terrible beast with the help of the gods, haven't you? Oh, I forgot my, my voice for him. Uh, that's right, the village pays homage to the gods and the sacred tree. And this year is the 100th anniversary of the beast's beat, uh, defeat. I'd better finish that bamboo where I want to set off the festival. 
Hot dog? I just love festivals. But we gotta remember to go back to Kamiki Village on that day. Oh, and by the way, Wolfie, I'd like to give you a little something to thank you for your help in the hot spring digging game. It isn't much, but you may find it useful. Here you go. Now we get mermaid coins, and this also unlocks the ability to actually buy them, too. Thanks, Gramps. Well, that's some grubby pocket change. There are many small springs known as mermaid springs across Nippon. Yeah, 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 we know. This is a fast, this is a fast travel system. I explained this last time. <laughs> okay. Oh, what else do you have to say? Uh, hmm. Well, anyways, since we have this bimp, this uh, mermaid coin, let's swim over to this. And then we use the mermaid coin. It drops in. And then, once you've, once you're over, once you are over the mermaid, the mermaid spring right there. Pick your destination. We need to go to a Gata Forest, and well, so we shall. Once again, my timing is off of that minigame. And hey, we are exactly where we need to be. Okay. So, let's go ahead. Uh, talk to Kushi again. And now that we have the Water Spout ability, in it goes. That's odd. How did the water get into the barrel all by itself? Do it once again, and then a third time. And the barrel's all filled up. Now, how are you gonna carry that? I mean, that that's a big barrel of water. Yay, how wonderful. The barrel's full of spring water already. This will be plenty for the holy sake for the festival. Excellent. Now we just have to get it back to the village. Uh, carry it home? But it must weigh a ton. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh, hi there. Come to ruin our fun? What is it? Do, do you want some of the spring water? Sorry, I'll be getting this barrel out of your way soon. Oh, hello. Well, that barrel's like holy and stuff. Hmm. That's some power in that barrel. Back, you beast! Suzano comes to the rescue. Here I am, just taking a walk. And look what I run into. Oh, it's you. Susano. Oh, Susano, are you going to deal with these guys now? T take one more step towards the lady and it'll be your last. Wow. The great Susano, descendant of the hero Nagi, forbids it. Do not despair, my fair Kushi. Susano is here to save the day. <laughs> oh, that's oh, that's sad. Uh oh, this looks bad. I I swing my sword in the name of love, Susano style sword of passion. Here I go. All right, let's, Susano, let's see your stuff. Leave my. Kushi alone. Huh? Not done yet. Susana, watch out. Alright. Please, Susano, you took out those monsters all by yourself. Hey, you did it, Pops. That was amazing. You look kind of scared at first, but you pulled it off for the lady. <laughs> just eat e soon. Susano, um, thank you. 
I didn't expect to see such ferocious monsters here. Are oh, you hurt? Susano? I knew it. I knew it all along. Strange things have been happening ever since then. First that boulder and Kamiki, and then that battle with the bear, and now this. My sword is possessed by a strange power. You listen to me, O oh spirit, who files my sword. I shall not be controlled by some puppet. By the gods, I shall expose your nefarious scheme. Uh, Susanna, are you gonna help with that water barrel? <laughs> Gross wolf spit! <laughs> the magnificent Isun takes offense. Why I oughta. Hmm? Miss Susano? Where did he go running off to? He left without saying a word. What was he thinking? I mean, he just won the battle. Now it's time to win the damsel's heart. At least he could have stuck around to help carry the barrel. It's okay. I think he's busy with other things. There's no need to bother him with this. I sure I can manage on my own from here anyway. Oh, hello. Uh, I know that sound. It's Kokari. That sounded like that Kokari kid. Is he in trouble again? We better go check it out, Ami. Oh, hello. Well, the canine tracker suddenly appeared. So that means, uh, Kushi, you want some help there? <laughs> it's so heavy. You couldn't give me a hand, could you, Snowy? Wake up, sister. Does it look like my furry friend could carry that? This area should be free of evil power. And the water has sacred properties. So you definitely won't be attacked on the way back. Not the problem, me soon. Just... It's like... It's, a. Uh, never mind. He ain't li he's not listening to me. Anyways, where is Kokari? Uh, that must be him over here. Uh, you need some help? <laughs> wow, looks like you got a big one there, kid. With all that noise you were making, I was sure the monsters... Uh, oh, hello. And he's got a doggo in his mouth. Oh no! Ume! Shoot, my line snapped! Curse you, Whopper. I'm gonna catch you. You're gonna pay for what you did to Ume. Alright, you want some help? Hey kid, where the humongous fish came from? It was it, wasn't that your dog Ume in, some, in its mouth? That was the legendary fish Whopper. They say it swallowed the moon reflected on the water's surface. So it really, so it really does live in these deep, murky waters. Well, it's gonna pay for gobbling up good old Ume. Sheesh, that shot, that dog sure does get eaten a lot, doesn't he? I don't, I don't have any fishing line left, but I'll snag that whopper yet. This should be a battle to avenge Ume. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do it. Time for another fishing mini game. It would it works just the same as last time. Yeah, I, I get the basic idea. Alright, so we'll we're gonna have to catch us an, another two fish before we can get to the whopper. Alright, but first, what do we have here? Come on. Get over here. Alright, now what fish are you? What have I caught? Uh, Achilles fish. Int interesting name. Uh, how about you? Alright, get over here. Uh, okay, you're different. Uh, what are you? Uh, a goby. Neat. There he is. 
All right, you're you're ours, Whopper. All right, this will not go as easy as last time because I slice him once. Yeah, he ain't done yet. You get you're gonna have to do it again. Come on, get over here. Come on, Kakari, put your back into it. All right. Then that's it. Whopper is ours. Nice. That's one whopper of a fish. Man, you got another demon fang on top of it, so that's pretty neat. I knew I could do it. I finally caught Whopper. <laughs> and here I was so worried about you, kid. You know, one fine fisherman. You should be proud of yourself. Keep on fishing. And make sure to bring along plenty of line. How could I ever fish again? I mean, what about Ume? He's never coming back. Oh boy, the crybaby's back. Don't worry. After all, you... Hmm? Oh, well, hang on. And the, wa and the water's glowing. Hmm, what's that about? Ah, <sighs> uh, yeah. That's right. Whopper swallowed the surface as... Uh, well... God, I... Ugh. Let me try this again. The That's right. Whopper uh, swallowed the reflection of the moon. Oh, look. The surface of, of the deep abyss is as bright and shiny as a mirror. The moon's reflection sure looks beautiful. Hmm? What was the moon? Now, come on, I can, I can only see its reflection. Oh, but wait. You know what time it is. It's time for another brush technique. Uh, I spoiled this in like part in like part nine and then was like in the editing process. Maybe I should cut this out. Just out of respect for people who don't like the spoilers. Anyways, let's make a constellation. No, this is no, this is not Katamari. This is Okami. So you know. And what? Are, what are you doing? He's beating up some Play-Doh. Okay then. I'm sure, I'm sure if I knew the mythology of this god, I would understand that. Ah, Hamaturasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. After your departure, I hid myself within the moon's reflection. Consumed by a fish, I patiently awaited this day in its belly. Now that a glimmer of hope has returned, I have returned. I, Yumigami, god of the moon. Cover the earth in pale moonlight. Use this light in conjunction with your own on your perilous journey. Very nice. And yeah, Japanese mythology, rabbits have a lot to do with the moon for some reason. That's also why uh, some of the bad guys in Mario Odyssey were rabbits. And also why you went to the moon, because of that. It's a whole thing. Yumi Gami, the god of moon power. So Rappa really did swallow up the moon reflected on the water. Now you have the crescent brush technique. That one lets you draw a crescent moon in the sky. It's said to have uh, to have the power to turn day into night. I wonder if it really works. Could drawing a curved line in the sky really bring out the moon? Why don't we find out he soon? And yet, yeah, if and yeah, if I could have done this uh, with that with that creepy little house by Sasa Sanctuary. It, this that this would that this brush technique would this brush technique would have made that so much easier. Oh well, the moon! The moon it's come out! Now you have the power to turn day into night. <laughs> Think of the nighttime pleasures that await. I know that sounds tempting, but first things first. We still have that matter uh, Princess Fruse asked us to deal with. Oh and suddenly Ume 
Hey, uh, it's Ume! He came out of Whopper's mouth, now that we saw it. You okay, boy? I knew it would spit Ume out. That's why I told you not to worry. I mean, just look at him. He looks like one uh, nasty tasting king and I. Really? Yeah. Never seen an uglier looking dog in my life. Uh, you want to take that back, Isun? What? Is something something wrong? Just trying to have a little fun like I do with Furball here. White Wolf, how did you come to bear the canine track? Hmm? There's a familiar scent in the air. My former comrades. It emanates from your body. What the? Oh, well, it's none of your business how we smell. It's just that we don't like taking baths, that's all. Hey, wait, did he just say something about the canine tracker? Yep, the canine tracker decrees that its bearer shall prove his strength. I shall be the one to test it. Alright, this is the last of the canine warriors that we have to find. Canine warrior Jin. What the? You're one of the eight canine warriors? I mean, this dog means business. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna pick a fight. Why not? How many other fights have I... I, I mean, I picked fights with with half the canine warriors at this point. Bring on Snaggletooth. Nice. Alright. Alright, this is the last canine warriors about to fight uh, in this whole game. Uh... Oh, and he... Oh, and he... Oh, and he... He poops on the floor. Thanks. That will disorient you. Although I'm sure that's not a surprise. Uh, yeah. I think that blows up too. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, I thought so. And I don't think that's what they mean by a dirty bomb. Yeah, you're not getting out. You did get me with that. Oh, ow! That took off a whole thing of health. All right, come on. Do your worst. Okay, you've got a longer combo than the other ones that we fought. Aside from uh, the, the one with the scar on, on his eye. Alright, well, he's down for the count. And that's the last of them. How'd I do? Uh, not pretty solid. Pretty solid. I like that, I like that ranking. I know Princess Fuse summons me. It is my duty to defeat Crimson Helm, the fire of Gale Shrine. But this child and his father saved me from certain death. I owe my life to them. What am I to do? No need to do anything. The orb's coming with me. Thank you very much. And I got the Justice Orb. What's this? The Power Orb has chosen you. I don't need to worry. Oh, Power Orb is just the generic, is just like the catch all name for all of them. Some just have specific names. If it's separated, the hearts of the canine warriors beat as one. I shall spend the rest of my years here under the guise of Ume. What? You're not going back to the princess? After all we went through. He, I mean, look, looks like we found the three Satomi Power Orbs that the canine warriors had. Hmm. I know we promised to bring the dogs back, but... Well, at least we can bring Princess Fuse the Power Wards. But, I wonder... You think they can handle Crimson's Helm over the over a Gale Shrine? I'm sure they'll be fine. Well... Alright, well, we need to head back there anyway. Uh, I would cut ahead right here, but I want to check to make sure... The merchants will actually sell mermaid coins right now. I mean, Mr. Bamboo did say that they sell them, so, I mean, that does, that should trigger them to sell. Uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, one, give me three of them. Okay, well, now I will see you back with Princess Fuse. Alright then, we are back. Now then, uh, okay, I guess she's in here then. Alright, so unfortunately we don't have the other three dogs, but we got the orbs, I guess. That should be good. Anyways. Why, it's my favorite wolf and bug. Enough with the bug thing already. 
I must speak to you about the three remaining canine warriors. I am sensing something different about them. Do you bring no word of their condition or whereabouts? Well, um, about that. We did find the other, the other three, but... Uh... You found them? Well, yeah. It's kind of a long story, but I'm afraid they won't be coming back. Instead, they gave us the Satomi Power Warps. I see. Well, I did sense that the Canine Warriors had changed in some way. Maybe they had a fateful encounter during their journey. Perhaps strong bonds that cannot be broken have been forged. If they are to live apart from the Satomi House, I have but one wish. I would wish them to protect the peace under their new master. But that is the role they were meant to fulfill. Well, anyways, uh, Princess, I got the other power orbs for you. Nice. And they're all they're all together. Well, at any rate, all the Satomi power orbs have been returned. Now I can break Crimson Helm's barrier. I must get to the shrine. Oh wait. I guess you won't be doing that. I guess we're going to take care of that. Well, check it out. The power orbs are spinning around us. How could this be? Have the power orbs accepted you as their new masters? Master? What are you talking about, lady? One does not choose to take the orbs. They choose their master. Oh, my nephews of power orbs, heirlooms of the Satomi house. Are these whom you have chosen to decide the Satomi house's fate? I uh, guess they have. Well, you know what? What did they say? Uh. Oh, thank you. Thank you, but I'm, my, my pap is already full. Um, well, the Satomi Power Orbs have chosen us to uh, save the Gale Shrine. I think, they're, I think they have chosen wisely. I feel. Well, anyways, uh, let's go to the Gale Shrine then. Okay, it's just through here. Um, yeah, I want to make it night. I bet you anything, there's a treasure over here. Yeah. Yeah. Um, is there anything over here? Okay, there's a clover right there. Yeah, I do want to dig this up. Uh, there's bunnies over here. I'll feed them later. Uh, no. What's some... No, those are monkeys. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's some evil energy coming out of that. Oof. I don't want the look of that. Well, anyways. Uh, here's the Gale Shrine. Ooh. <gasps> Ooh, that's bad looking. And I, th I'm, I think my eyes deceive me. There was someone. Yeah, there's someone floating right there. Oh, hi, Suzano. Suzano starts to be monk, hidden sake. What the? Well, looky here, it's Suzano again. Oh, spirit who defiles my sword. I'm closer than ever. Here at the Gale Shrine, where the beast makes its lair. Your true form shall be revealed. This cursed baron may bar my way, but if I pray long and hard, I shall eventually find a way in. Well, is he bumps talking in his sleep? Because <laughs> he doesn't wake, from, wake up from that. Alright. What the heck is this guy? Hey, what's with this guy? You can see right through him. Hmm? Who are you? How is it you can see me? I am Yatsu, the earthbound spirit who haunts this area. Long has it been since any have ventured this way. Uh, earthbound spirit, Yatsu. My eyes have failed me. I can no longer see. In their stead, my inner eye can judge a person's true form. 
You appear to be a maiden, most fair. What could possibly bring you to the Gale Shrine? You must leave this place, for it is no longer a shrine of the gods. It is now cursed and under the control of a horrible creature. This is no place for a fair maiden such as you. Fair maiden? Are you talking about you for a while? That's the funniest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> What's this? It appears that the maiden is accompanied by a little booger. Is the village to meet its end at last? Little booger? He better not be talking about me. Hardly anyone has visited the Gale Shrine since it has been cursed. The strangely frenzied man over there is one of the few. He has been meditating alone at the shrine's entrance, but his sleep is filled with nightmares that make him cry out. I pity the poor man and would like to render what service I could, but when I try to peer into his dreams, an evil force bars my way. Who is this strange man? Come to think of it, Suzano said something about being possessed. He's been acting all weird, like that time he helped Kushi. What's this? I sense an intense power. It envelops your body. Could it be the Satomi power orbs? Fair maiden, the orbs would only choose the one who is our savior. The colors of light, living proof that of that. Very well, you may pass our savior at the Satomi house. All right. Grant me passage to tell me power orbs. Beware, fair maiden. Crimson Helm is a terrible foe. It is said that when the eight-headed serpent was slain 100 years ago, Crimson Helm emerged from a pool of the beast's blood. Never let your guard down. Elias is on Wait, wait, wait! The door to the Gale Shrine has opened! I must have finally communed with the gods! The time has come, foul spirit! Now I shall reveal your true form! Bye bye, Suzano! Uh, just be careful in there. No pops, wait! Is that life dear to that man? Beware, fair maiden. Yeah. That's all he has to say, the, the is that life not dear to Sano. Alright, well, and and to the Gale Shrine we go. We will explore the Gale Shrine next time. See you guys in part twelve.